Hi, my name is Dr. Ang and I'm an obstetrician and gynecologist working in Glenigos Medical Center. I have special interest in maternal fetal medicine as well as laparoscopic surgery for gynecological conditions. Today I'll be answering your questions related to C-sections. I hope my answers will be helpful to you. I recently gave birth to my child via C-section. I hear the recovery time after a C-section is longer than after a natural birth. Is this true? I would also like to know what the risks are for both my baby and I. Why will my baby get less nutrients, probiotics or protective bacteria? Will the surgery have an impact on breastfeeding? It normally takes about a month for a caesarean wound to heal completely. I usually advise my patients to resume normal sports activity only after three months as the abdominal muscles may have torn during the pregnancy and operation. This can cause pain during strenuous activity. A diet rich in proteins and vitamins, especially vitamin C, is advised in the post-operative period. The risk of C-sections to the mother are that of bleeding, which in rare circumstances can result in massive bleeding that may endanger the mother's life or necessitate the removal of the womb in order to stop bleeding. The other risk is that of infection of the wound, resulting in delayed healing and a longer recovery period. In women with repeated C-sections, there may be injuries to the bladder or intestines during the separation of adhesions. As mentioned earlier, women with repeated caesarean sections may have their placenta growing into the scar tissue, resulting in what we call placenta accreta, and this can cause uncontrolled bleeding, which may require the removal of the womb in order to save the mother. As for the baby, there are studies indicating that babies born via C-section have a higher chance of getting allergies compared to natural birth babies. This may be due to the fact that natural birth babies would have acquired good protective bacteria as they descend through the birth canal. A baby delivered by C-section does not acquire the good protective bacteria and this delays the growth of good protective bacteria affecting the maturation of the immune system. This results in high incidence of infection for the baby as well as allergies. To combat this, breastfeeding is strongly encouraged for the first six months and as long as possible. Breast milk contains antibodies and is rich in good bifidus bacteria, known as probiotics. This helps to quickly establish a healthy intestinal flora for your baby and helps support the maturation of the immune system. Babies who are or cannot be breastfed may consider a formula containing probiotics. Proven probiotics like bifidus are well documented to reduce incidences of diarrhea and respiratory illnesses in babies. Thank you for spending time with us today on AsianParent.com. If you have any queries, please click on the link below to send them in. Thank <laughs> you.